Can somebody please explain to me? I just noticed. Can somebody please explain to me why the door to the Pokemon Center is not your typical Pokemon Center door? It's just a regular, normal wooden door. Anyways, welcome back to another Pokemon Pokemon Rocket Strike playthrough. Uh, another part. This is part six, I believe. I could be wrong, but I'm 100% sure it's part six. Um, so yeah, as you can see, I grinded up a little bit on spe specifically Mankey, and I also caught a few Pokemon in the area. Um, the only two Pokemon that were in the area, aside from the ones we caught last last part, were Diglett and Sansru. Of course, I caught both just to get it over with. I also went ahead and bought a few, or rather, not a few, but a handful of repels. And I also got, uh, I also bought a few more Pokeballs, just in case. I don't think we're gonna need that much, but just in case we run into some rare Pokemon that just, into some Onyx <laughs> that wants to waste our Pokeball, that's gonna take like 10 or 15 Pokeballs to catch. So it's just we have some of them. Um, so we're gonna lead off with our strongest Pokemon here. We don't know what we will find. I'm kinda scared about the level jump. Anyways, let's go inside. Mount Moon. The name here hasn't changed, but the layout has changed. Holy mackerel. And already we have our first wall encounter. It's a Paris. Now, I don't think this thing has enough to hurt me, has anything to hurt me. This thing, this thing is a grass type, but it doesn't have anything to hurt me, I believe. Um, because the movesets are the same as the Gen 3 movesets. Yeah, it's John Spore. Um, okay, you didn't took that, that, much, that much catch. Um... Okay, another... Oh, Baltoy! Okay, so something that I've noticed is that I'll, there are a lot of ground types around here. Sandile, I also caught, of course, Diglett and Sansu. I caught them off-screen, of course. Um, but there are a lot of ground types. Geodude... Like, it's gonna be... Uh, if you want a ground type on your team, if you're playing this game and you want a ground type on your team, like... It's early in the game, you have access to a lot of ground types, and Balto is actually a pretty underrated uh, ground psychic type. Um, I kind of want to use Claydol in a playthrough. I've never used Claydol in a playthrough, but I really want to. Of course it's not going to be this one, because uh, of course it got sand out there. There's a lot of competition for, for ground types. So it's going to be pretty hard to for me to choose. Uh, Balto also. Balto is a psychic type, and I believe there are gonna be a lot of good psychic types later in the game. I'm not gonna slap on the repel now. I wanna see what else we can find here in Mount Moon. Man, it's Mount Moon is is the same name, but the layout has changed, man. It's so cool. This new Mount Moon looks so cool. And what's more, there are no trainers here. There's no trainers in here. Man, these diglets have arena trap. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go fishing here. I'm gonna test my luck and see if, if we can find a Pokemon. No Pokemon here? Whatever. I believe we were gonna get a Magic Arbor Phyllis anyway, so I could have been wasting my time. I could be wrong, but I'm not gonna waste my time here. I'm just gonna go off screen. <laughs> if I'm gonna do catch a Pokemon or grind, I'm gonna do it off screen. I'm not gonna waste my time now. Okay, so pretty much straightforward. There are no trainers for now. And there goes the arena trap. Excellent. So far. Oh! Oh, nice. That's a Lily. Nice, we got a rare, we got a rare fossil, one of the, one of the fossils, right here. 
And I'm not gonna mess around with this thing. I'm not gonna mess the hell around with this thing. You're resistant to, to you're part grass. Yeah, you resistant. You resist that. Um, how hard are you to catch? Oh, you're gonna be hard to catch. You're gonna be hot. You're gonna be a pain to catch. You're gonna be a pain to catch. I brought with me a handful of Pokeballs. I don't care. I'm gonna use them. <laughs> that's what we got. That's what we brought a lot in a lot of Pokeballs. I knew we were gonna run into a rare Pokemon. Good thing we did. One of the fossils. Wait. If Lilip is if if Lilip is here, does that mean that Anori is here as well? Just wanna search for a little bit. Imagine if a shiny Pokemon appears out of nowhere, man. I would freak out. Hmm. Oh, just. Oh, I, w I was thinking, where was Subat? <laughs> Why hadn't Subat popped up yet? Popped in yet? There you go, checking in as always. In your natural habitat. In your natural habitat. Um. Yeah, I'm actually gonna go with Spiro here. Spiro is not that it's not that it's reliably not that strong compared to the other guys. Yeah. Um Oh man! <laughs> Speaking of good ground types, we got trap in here. You got arena trap, right? Yep. You got arena trap. I don't think a tackle should. I don't think a tackle will kill though. Um, you're gonna be a dick. What about this? No, you're not. You're gonna be a good boy. <laughs> good boy, trap inch. Good boy, trap inch, man. Man, I w man. Now I want a flygon. Just when we were talking about having a crocodile or a cladle, look who pops up. It's a flygon. Okay. Um. Oh, there are trainers here. I think I spotted some guy there. A moonstone. Oh ho 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 ho! I could do this right now. Because seriously, Nidorino learns absolutely nothing of use after after like. What's the thing that it does? Horn attack? I mean, I could evolve it at level 23 on Needle King because I don't want to miss out on horn attack. I'm gonna evolve Needle Reno when once he learns the moment he learns horn attack because I don't want to miss out on that attack. But that's pretty much the only attack I don't want Needle Reno to miss out on. After that, I mean, he learns as a Needle King. He learns Thrash at level 23, so it's whatever. Plus, um. Needle King learns most of his attacks via TM, but I don't know, man. Again, Needle King is a ground type. And we have already so many options for ground types. We got Golem. We got freaking freaking Flygon. We got Kaladal. We got Crocodile. You throw Needle King into the mix, man. Oh, and of course, speaking of ground types, Marshall Beast 1 2! Marston is one too. What's it gonna be? A ground type I don't have. Oh, it's Yodus. Okay, scratch that. It's a ground type, but I already got you. So what is a blood sucker? No, no shit, Sherlock. Leech life got buff in Generation Seven. I'm scared of leech life. I'm scared of my life for leech life. <laughs> okay, you're a scientist. So you're most probably gonna use. So you're most probably gonna use a magnemite. If you use a psychic, if you send in a psychic type, I'm gonna look like a moron. Okay, it's a double battle. Hmm. Now that I now that I, now that I take a closer look, um, level 15, like the, there hasn't been any level jump because we got we got faced level 15 guys at level 15 before, but still. These guys are one level higher than the first gen leader, so you can already see that there is a there is a it's not a big level jump, but there is it's still a level jump nonetheless. Uh, 
A potion. <laughs> oh, as if we hadn't had enough of those. I want a super potion, though. To heck with potions, man. I want a super potion now. Oh, there you are. There you are. Yeah, because I was talking about Lilith. And when I caught Lilith, I was talking, when will you... When will you show up? There you go. I don't want to kill you. Well, uh, I already has nothing to hurt Spiro with. It only has Scratch. Yeah, keep hardening and don't crit. 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 Okay. Okay, let's throw Pokeballs now and hope for the best. Oh my gosh, I know if it's gonna be a- Oh my gosh! Oh, catch! Get caught! Finally, thank you. What's this thing's catch rate, by the way? It must be- It can be 45, man. It can be- That catch rate, it cannot be 45. Well, I guess we slap on a repel now. If I want something else, I'm, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do it off screen. Mm. To heck with this! We're gonna switch now. This bug catcher won't know what hit him. Yep, this guy won't know what hit him. Horrible mistake on leading up with with two of the worst bug type Pokemon out there. An escape rope. Nice, real nice. Is this a girl that has the grass that the grass type Pokemon? Oh, oh no. Oh, that has Blitzel. I just realized <laughs> Blitzel is our starter. Blitzel was our starter and our starter Pokemon. He's not even on the team. Wow. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> How times have changed. But the thing is that compared to Luxray, Substrika is not that good. I used Substrika in my first ever playthrough of Pokemon White, uh, like, 8, um, what year is 2019, uh, 8, yeah, eight, 8 years ago, my first ever playthrough of Pokemon White, I used this Substrika on my team, and it was good, but I could have done much better. My brother used, uh, my little brother who had Pokemon Black, had a Galvantula on his team, and it was a beast, I remember that. We used to battle on. We used to battle every time via infrared or via the infrared connection you got on the Sea Gear, and man, that that Galvantula always gave me issues, man. Speaking of giving, speaking of issues, I am a Team Rocket Rock Grunt who's going through the ranks, giving trainers like Buck Catchers issues. I don't conquer the world because I don't want to. I don't steal people's Pokemon because I don't want to. Stealing people's Pokemon, like, that is so lame for an evil team. Evil teams, like Team Rocket, want to conquer the world, not not commit some petty, not commit some petty ads. Slap on another repair right there. Uh, you're gonna have fighting type, I believe. You're gonna have fighting type, I believe. Is my prediction right? Is my prediction right? No. Yeah, because the last beauty we fought had a fighting type. So I thought for sure that you were gonna have one. But it looks like beauties do not have a set type to focus on. See? See what I mean? Rosalia. Oh my gosh. Oh, you don't have... You don't have Mega Drain? What? You didn't use Mega Drain, that's weird. Uh, well, good thing we picked up a Paralyzed Heal. That way we can save up our berries for later. Hmm. Okay, there's a Hiker there. It's gonna have a Nonix and... Ah! Oh! <sighs> why, why, why you gotta do this to me? Why? Uh, uh, uh. You're gonna pay for this. We're gonna pay for this. This was supposed to be my time. 
This was supposed to be March Dom's time. And you... Well, you didn't ruin it, but... You screwed it over. I was gonna use... I was gonna... I was gonna use a sneak attack on that hiker and this girl just pops up out of nowhere. And she just kami in front of me with her... With her little weed. With her little weed Pokemon that has a higher base attack stat than Onyx. <laughs> Yes, that's right, you heard me right. Oh, it's just a higher base attack stat than Onyx. I still can't believe that. Shug me. Oh, you're just a kid. Well, I still managed to pull off a sneak attack on him. At least he didn't turn around. Yeah, Marsh Tom could actually... Oh, Cranny those. Oh, it has Intimidate! No! I'm much of this physical in this game. He's not gonna KO now. Ah, uh, just barely, it just barely, he lived on one. And he has Onyx, yeah, whatever. Oh, this guy is Jin Little Roar. This guy is Roar, he has Geodude, Onyx, and Crandles. What is Roar doing in Kanto? He got beaten by our team Rocket Grunt. And uh, why is he going by the name of Marcus? You're not Marcus, you're Roar. I beat a Jin Leader from the Sino region. That is the same team he has. Where is my badge? I mean, I know we're not in Sino, but still, give me my badge. I beat you in a match fair and square. And don't give me that BS that no, we're not in, we're not in the gym. I beat you fair and square. Give me my badge. We're a candy, pretty good. Hmm. There's there's another exit. Wonder where it will lead me. Uh, let's explore. Let's explore, uh, Swina. Team of Bullet Seed. Um, cool, I guess. Um, nothing here. Anything down here? Did I went through here? Yeah, I went through here. Well, there's nothing else to explore here. Man, this game is expansive. Wait, do they lead to the same place? Yeah, they do. Oh, this is Team Magma. First of all, wait, that's here. An antidote, cool. This is Team Magma. So, mm, Marsh Dump, go do your job. Okay, so we're gonna be competing with evil teams. Like, the evil, we are the evil teams. And the quote-unquote evil teams are not the good guys, they are other evil teams. So we're like competing with Dominance of the World. It's pretty cool. And look, instead of Puchienas, they have Rotatas. <laughs> this this is the Team Magma branch from the Kanto region, I didn't know that. It's pretty cool. Mm. This is, I didn't know Team Magma was in, uh, had, a, had a base in Kanto, where the grunts, instead of Puchienas, they use Rotatas. Well, at least they use spout toys. Um, yeah, if I beat win, you're gonna have one of you is gonna have to take a step back because I gotta pass. If I beat you, you you girls are gonna have to let me pass. One of you is gonna have to move aside. Um, well, at least you girls used. Uh, <laughs> of course, I knew I was. I knew leading with Marston was a great idea. Marston be such an MVP, man. Pokemon Twister. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to go back. I'm gonna have to go back and climb back. Okay. Hmm, something tells me this is gonna be a double battle. I'm not liking the sound of this. Man, I don't really like <laughs> I don't really like Marsh Dump hogging all the experience, but man, he's the only guy, he's the guy that can that can get <laughs> he's the only guy that can take this guy that can take this uh, this Pokemon on right now. Like there are so many fire and ground types, this is gonna be a huge advantage for him. Hmm. I mean like look at this. Hmm. Sans Sandile, dead. Oh well, oh well. I was gonna say, you're level 17, so you may not die that fast. Growlithe, aww. 
Aww. Well, I mean, man, how could a great Pokemon be used for? How could such a loyal Pokemon be used for such an evil team? Oh, and another Moonstone. Yeah. See now. Property of Team T Magma. Uh, I suggest you leave before I. Uh, um, are you on crack? <laughs> are you on crack? Who's this guy? Marcus. Oh, of course. So this is the Team Magma that is situated in Kanto. You see, so Team Magma is not only in Hoenn. Uh, Team Magma also has other branches in Kanto that we do not know about. Um, one of the admins from the Team Magma that is situated in Kanto is called Marcus. So I I, I know what's going on now. I'm actually scared. This thing, if this thing no self-destruct. Ah! No! See what I mean? Man, and coughing gives out pretty good experience. I could have potentially gone on a level if Marshall stayed alive. Oh, this is bad. It just bombed me. It just bombed my MVP away. And I have no freaking revives. I'm angry. Avenge his death, Mankey. Or rather, he did not die. Because this is not an Oslo. We can just go to a Poke Pokemon Center and, and just revive him. And Torkoal. Oh, man. <sighs> this is gonna be a pain. Torkoal is gonna be such a freaking pain to deal with, man. Marston would have been so good, uh, but I got I found no revive. Ah, he's level 20. Oh my gosh. He's cursing. Bite, okay. Bite. No. No. You have healing items, please don't don't heal. Okay, you have no healing items. Thank you. At least Lucio took care of things and didn't miss, thankfully. Quick attack. I mean, sure, why not? Replace tackle. Okay, so the move sets uh, from the Pokemon from the first from the Pokemon from Gens 1 to 3 are not changed. But the Pokemon from Gens 4 to 6, since they have from the Pokemon for later Gens, since they have to be coded in. And of course, since they don't learn attacks like, for example, he doesn't learn, Luxio doesn't learn Thunderfang, Luxray doesn't learn Thunderfang or Discharge. Your are not strong for your age. Thank you. Helix Fossil. No. Oh. I don't have a choice. It's just a heli the Helix Fossil. Okay. Uh, okay then. What fossil was yours? You didn't take me with you. What was that all about? Anyways. Oh, revive. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That way, if something pops up out of nowhere, we are ready for that. We can face anything that comes our way now. We should be good now. The team of thief. This could be fine. Somebody's gonna surprise us. I just know what. The moment we go up the stairs, star piece. We're gonna sell it for more, mo more cash. Back on row one of four. To Shimmer City. Okay, punch of roaring. This is mega punch. Oh, these are these are the move, the move tutors. Uh, no mega kick. No. I kind of want to fish, but I don't wanna. Can I come back here, please? Oh yes, you can. Yes. Okay. I can. So I can come back. You come back. I can come back whenever I want to. Okay. Okay. So this is a different area. 
So this is a different area, which means that there's gotta be some different Pokemon here. Let's see what we can find. Uh, pretty much the same Pokemon from Mount Moon and the other guys. But who knows, there could be a rare Pokemon. There we go! That's a rare Pokemon. <laughs> you pursued at me, but I'm such a high level, it doesn't matter. That attack didn't even tickle me. Spearow! Um, nah, man, now I gotta track down that Doduo again. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> I'm not going to. I am not going to use Marsh Jump anymore. I'm not gonna use Marsh Jump anymore for catching Pokemon. I'm not gonna use Marsh Jump anymore for catching Pokemon. I'm gonna put it at the back. Hey man, now I gotta track down that Doduo. And I don't know how rare is that Dodo because since there are so many Pokemon in in the same area, like 10 Pokemon per area, then that means that some of these encounters could be a chance encounter. Like for example, look at look at this. Look at Surskit. Don't look at me with a straight face and tell me that this Surskit is common. Surskit is rare, man. Like, I don't know if Surskit had a 1% chance to appear in this route, which is why I do not want to, to kill it. Okay, so it looks like Dodo is pretty common around here. Okay, you lower my attack, which means a quick attack won't kill now. Oh yeah, it won't kill. No! Why I keep doing this? Why does this always happen to me? I want a Doduo! I'm so into this, I don't want to catch it off screen, man. I don't want to waste all this time so just so I can catch a freaking... Just so, so I end up catching Doduo off screen, no. I wasted so many time... I wasted so much time on you. Now uh, why not? Might, might as well get a few, some experience because Spiro. One. Well, Spiro Balls are level 20, so why not? Oh. Oh, yes, 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 yes. It's not Doduo, but. If you crit, I swear. Man, Aaron has quite a... Okay. I was gonna say, Aaron has a pretty... I was gonna say, Aaron has a pretty low catch rate. And there we go, another one. Don't kill. Spiro. Spiro is doing this pretty experienced, man. Spiro is doing this pretty experienced. Spiro knows that it is about to evolve. Spirit knows that she. He, Spirit knows that he's about to evolve, so that's why he is critting everything because he wants to get that experience so that he can level up and evolve. Okay, pursuit is a special base attack. You won't even if it crits. Yeah, it, I was gonna say even if it crits, you won't be able to kill it. We caught Doduo, but now we gotta get Kirubon. There we go. Yeah, keep pursuing that thing. Yeah! <laughs> See, you can't kill things now anymore, can you, Spiro? You don't feel invincible. You don't feel invincible anymore, eh, Spiro? Yeah. I want you and I want you... No! No, this is so wrong on so many levels. Gambler, yeah! You're about to risk it all with me! I want you and I want you now! You're about to risk it all, man! But let me tell you something. <laughs> let me tell you something. You're in for a real treat if you think you can. If you think you can just take advantage of, of, of me like that. You're in for a real treat, boy. Yeah, I let Spiro. <laughs> to be honest, I let Spiro die because um, he was kind of in a hopeless situation. I mean, it's Blitzo. It's a freaking Blitzo we're talking about. Poison Sting. I mean, Nidorino has no use for Leer anymore. I mean, <laughs> he finally got a stab attack. Hmm. 
So I guess we're gonna explore some of Shimmer City. Ha! <laughs> I just heal, man! I just healed! Do you know who you're messing with? I just healed! I just ended up healing! And this man... I just ended up healing. This man thought he could surprise me, but no! I just ended up healing! I just finished healing. No! I'm not gonna be... I'm not gonna be gentle with you. You ask for it. It doesn't matter, and it doesn't matter because I got the Poké Center running, that Nurse Joy right in front of me. <laughs> Team Rocket is... Team Rocket is what? Go on, man. Go on. Nobody messes with Team Rocket. I told you, nobody messes with Team Rocket. Oh my gosh, Venom is so annoying. This Venom is so annoying. Venom not playing the strats, man. I don't want to waste my potions. I got the focus center right there. If it dies, it dies. If this thing dies, it dies. It doesn't matter to me. Nothing here. Yeah, there's nothing upstairs, girl. I saw. There's nothing upstairs. You want to fight me too? No, okay. Um. Actually, let's see who else wants to fight. You wanna fight, little kid? Oh, you want to fight! Okay! Be my guest, man! Man, this city battles are great because you got the Pokemon Center right in front of you. It's just a fight, and then you just go back to heal. That's the best, that's the best fight, that's the best thing ever. Okay, um, I kind of don't want to heal after every battle, so, because I just want to get, no, I kind of want to get this over with. Uh, I wish I could run this up with a gank partner. Uh, and that partner you're, ta you're talking about. I'm gonna buy a over there, distract me. My other Pokemon will distract Oh yeah, fighting in a bike shop. Yeah, let's burn some bikes. You're gonna use Solar Beam on me, am I right? <laughs> Solar Beam Magikarp, guys. Solar Beam Magikarp. Real nice, Magikarp. Real nice. It would have been kind of scary if... It would have done kind of some damage if... If he used it on Marshdown, but Marshdown could survive a Solar Beam fire from a Magikarp. In fact, anyone survives anything from Magikarp. Can I just steal the bike? I'm, I'm fronting Rocket. Leave my shop while I cry your ear off. Dude, I'm fronting Rocket. I can just steal the bike. Don't you know me? Oh my gosh. It's a slow bro. Am I gonna do it? Well, first I'm gonna fight the girl and then I'm gonna kill the slow bro. I want your Pokemon. Hm. Ah! You're level 23. You're powering up, you're setting up. No, no, no. Curse you, Slowbro. You're so bulky. There we go. Yeah, the only thing that can destroy Slowbro is like, it's a critical hit. And now we're gonna kill you. Uh. Okay. Okay then. Hmm. Oh, it's a Team Rocket member. Too much time to lose to this. Nothing to happen anywhere. Uh, hello? What are you watching? A Pokemon TV looks like it's having fun and you're bored? Okay then. Um. Hmm. Let's see. Who's the gym leader? You wanna fight me? I hope you don't wanna fight me, kid. Misty. So the gym leader is still Misty. Is this game complete? I just feel like this ROM hack is not really... I thought they were gonna change the team leader's names. Yep, there we go! 
Yeah, there we go. I'm not a trainer, I'm a Team Rocket Grunt. And I am going to kill you for messing up. And I am going to kill your Pokemon for messing up with me. I'm going to mess up your Pokemon because you got in my way. Don't get in the way of Team Rocket. Do you understand? Do you understand me, good, good boy? Okay. Oh, I already went here. Hmm. Who's in this house? I'm gonna rob you. I'm gonna rob your ass. Polywar for Beldum. Well, if you can catch Beldum anywhere else, because if I find out you can get a Beldum, then the trade will be redundant. So you know soldier boy, uh Okay, no disrespect to Soldier Boy. But if there was some old head out there who loves Soldier Boy and try rapping to their songs, then yeah, that would be kinda cringe. Only skill trainers can collect Pokemon badges? Uh what? Well there should be a hidden item around here, am I right? Yeah, rare candy. Hey, let's fight. Oh, pause it. Great. What's in this? Whatever. The people here were robbed. Somebody that's in rockets behind his boss and I'm probably sure were rockets. Oh, well. Looks like we've gone off for quite some time, so. Uh, guess I'm gonna do another part though. Guess I'm gonna do another part. I'm gonna be next time. We're gonna be. I guess we're gonna be finding our rival. I believe. Yeah, because we're getting to knock at bridge you now. So anyway, stay tuned. Uh, I'm gonna do a part seven today. I think. I hope. Uh, thanks for watching. Stay tuned. Uh, and. Uh, just have a good rest of the day, I guess.